Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, playing some more Bug Fables The Everlasting Sapling. Uh, last time we did a little bit of stuff around the Ant Kingdom here, uh, just like side quests and getting set up to make our way into the second chapter, uh, which we will be starting now. Let's go! Uh, the way to the second chapter is where we were, where we showed up after first the first chapter ended, so down here. Oh yeah, I forgot to equip the um bugby not badge. We should probably do that. Uh, well, we should be fine for the moment. We probably need to level a little bit anyway. Damn it, Carbo, you're letting us all down. <laughs> there we go. Oh, we're so close. One more battle. We found a hard seed. Alright, it may look like there's something over there on that ledge. There is, but we won't be able to get it for quite some time. So, uh, just keep that in mind. <laughs> oh gosh, uh, I think this is the time for something like this. Yeah, definitely. Bring that one down. Take that one out. And now we'll have two health left, there's exactly three of them, so... Easy peasy. <laughs> Bam, there we go. And that's a level up. Rank up. Okay, uh... If we were doing things in the right order, it'd be metal points next, but I messed up last time. <laughs> Just gonna have a little sneeze there. Uh, what we actually need to do is teamwork points if we want to balance it, balance things out. Because yeah, I should I was trying to do health then teamwork then metal, but I accidentally did metal first. So teamwork it is. There we go. Carby learned heavy strike. Uh, that's a skill Carby can use for a couple of TP. Uh, it's very helpful. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we'll switch on Bug Me Not, there we go. It probably wouldn't have been super helpful, because, yeah, we weren't high enough level uh, for these guys to be a pushover anyway, but it'll come in handy as we progress. Oh, I forgot about this. Somebody, help! I, I told you, you savages. I don't know anything. Hmm, the renowned Professor Neolith doesn't know anything? Spill the beans about the artifacts or pay with your life. Oh gods. Stop, I will not allow this injustice any longer. K Kabu! Assaulting someone who can't even fight? You have no dignity. Stay out of this, we will eliminate any who get in the way. Who do you think you are? You've made your choice. To protect my friend, I'll take you down. Friend? You only have yourselves to blame for the pain you're about to suffer. Halt. Those crooks are soldiers from the Wasp Kingdom. We'll help out. It doesn't matter how many of you appear, we will complete our mission for the Wasp King. Focus your efforts on one of them, we will handle the other one. We didn't need your help, but thanks, let's go! We probably did need the help. Wasps are pretty strong. Uh, we're gonna spy on this one so we get a good idea of how strong it is. Uh, move with the leaf. Oop, that's not what I want to do at all. Ah, uh, dang it. The 
The Wasp Kingdom. What could possibly justify sending soldiers to attack Bulgaria? For now, I'll focus on making sure they bring us no harm. Yeah, they have 10 health and 2 defense. Uh, so I'm gonna do 1 damage with this attack. Yeah. And even with a perfect block, they do 3 damage to me. Yeah, we're gonna have some trouble here. Um, I think we want probably Kabu in the front. Kabu has a point of defense piercing automatically. Uh, so if we combine that with Heavy Strike... We can get 4 damage in, which is pretty decent. Uh, we're gonna try freezing. It worked. Didn't do any damage, but it worked. Um, uh, you just do nothing for now, V. Just let them skip their turn. There we go. And get another four damage in there. There we go. And then... This will do no damage. Yeah. Kyber was the only one with defense piercing, so even though they're on one health, we can't actually defeat them until next turn. No one's actually do the trick. I don't think turn relay would have worked because if Kabu attacks again, it um, doesn't do as much damage because of the like exhaustion if you take multiple turns. Blast it all! We underestimated them. We must report this at once. Count your blessings, explorers. You won't be so lucky next time. Thank you. It would have been a steep fight without your help. Think nothing of it. Explorers must support each other. What a scare. Thank you all so much. I really thought I'd croak before finishing my research. Neo, I am so glad you're alright. Kabu, it was thanks to your timely appearance. This has to be fate. So, uh, who's this Professor Neolith guy? You don't know? Professor Neolith is the leading authority in archaeology. Oh, nice to meet you. Archaeology? Oh shucks, I'm not that famous. Neo and I met in the Lost Stands while I travelled to the Ant Kingdom. You helped me find my way. It was nothing compared to saving me from that ambush. Coincidentally, I was examining this tunnel linking the outskirts to the Golden Path. I never expected to get assaulted, although a less visited path does lend itself to it. From what I overheard, they seem to be looking for artifacts as well. I'll have to make sure to report that upon our return. The wasps will behave for a few moons, but they can't be planning anything good. If it's going to be this unsafe, maybe I should cancel this trip and head back. Professor, we're on a journey to the Golden Hills. We'd be glad to escort you. Uh... Uh, I, I don't know what Kabu said, because it was covered by what V said. I think it was, there goes my chance, and then V said, phew! Oh, thank you. We're on our way there as well, so we'll catch up to you eventually. <laughs> It'll be a fun festival with everyone there. Let's play some of the games later, Neolith. Neo, stay safe. Let's hang out later. By the way, uh, Neo and Ka Neolith and Kabu were a very popular ship. Um, I definitely ship it. They are very cute. <laughs> uh, we saw some of the reasons why just then, but there's some more interactions between them later. We'll see some more. They're very cute together. Did I already do this? This place is a bit unkempt. This used to be the popular route to the Golden Hills, but the northern part is preferred nowadays. Eh, at least it's a quiet place. No issues with me. Uh, oh, we had our resources restored anyway, so let's just continue. Cool. I wasn't sure if we were well equipped to continue into the cave, but we should be fine. This place is dreadful. Pretty sad if you ask us. It's not like anyone comes here often, you know? It does the job. Indeed, if we cross quickly, we can leave behind this great scenery. Uh, I think a numbnail has pretty good defense. Yeah, it has one point of defense. Oh, a numbnail! I hear numbnail sedatives go for a lot of berries on the market. I'll try to take some for myself when Kabu flips it out of its shell. Okay, we meant to flip it. Boop. No, we, we can't flip it. Alright. Mm -hmm. 
yeah, um, Numbnails inflict sleep, so V dismissed her turn. Um, they're kind of dangerous. <laughs> uh, sleep does heal you though, which is helpful. Uh, it can be a useful status effect. It's probably not the best status effect in the game. Oh, this will come up later. See these rocks? Yeah. Keep an eye on those. For, like, way later in the game, actually. It's gonna be a while. This is a midge. Let's spy on it. The reason we're attacking and then spying is because that way we do the most damage, because your second turn is the same character, uh, does less damage than the first one. Ugh, I've got stings everywhere. It just keeps hitting me back. I should try to take it out in one attack. Uh, we can all attack together. It should be fine. A single midge isn't a big deal, because a whole bunch of them it can be a bit of a problem. The sign is faded and you can barely make out what it says. Welk. I know what it says, but I'm not going to spoil it. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh no, there's two of them. Also, yeah, they can they can heal themselves when they attack you, so you got to watch out for that. Uh, that didn't go well. Uh... Oh dear. This is going very badly. I am not blocking these attacks well at all. Uh, we're gonna need to put Leaf in front again. Because uh, he's got the most health, and also we want to use Icefall so we can hit that guy. Because V is normally the only one who could hit it. Uh, and she's out of business. Out of action. <laughs> yeah, hard mode in this game is hard. Da -da. I was hoping to actually freeze them, which would have stopped them from doing their counter attack and therefore flying back up again. Uh, but they didn't get frozen. Uh... Uh, we should be okay. We could head back to town and sleep at the inn in order to heal, but I think we should be alright. We'll see how we go. This place is dreadful. Pretty sad if you ask us. I already looked at this, that's right. <laughs> and here are the Golden Hills! They're so pretty. Would you like to save? Yes! Saving, please stand by. Save complete! You found a crystal berry. There's one hidden back there, yeah. Ah, the Golden Hills. I've heard many stories about this place. They say Goddess Venus keeps this area in pristine weather. Where are all these leaves falling from anyways? Just look up. That's the Bee Kingdom's tree. I actually haven't looked at a lot of the tattling stuff in the game, so that was my first time seeing that one. I love how much flavor this game has. Uh, I want to lead by flipping the acornling with Carbo like this. Uh, then uh, I want to spy on it, so let's do that next. Seriously, a seedling with a hat? My beam ring can't pierce through. Carbo's gonna have to flip it. Okay. 
Warning, don't jump on the fly traps. Use the Safe Line Express to reach the settlement, Golden Hills Tourist Center. P.S. In case the Safe Line is out of commission, please wait until an associate comes to escort you. We have to jump on the fly traps. <laughs> Provided you don't stay still, you're fine. Uh, if one hits you, you just get sent back to earlier. Like, it, it doesn't kill you or anything. Oh, I got a little more health than I thought. We're gonna need to get a bit stronger. <laughs> Our team is still pretty weak. Yeah, the lift is out of commission, by the way, in case that wasn't clear. Uh, so we do have to jump on the fly traps and do all this stuff manually. There isn't actually a lift in this room, so I'm not sure how you're supposed to get past this with the lifts working. Oh my goodness, um, that's, that's quite a lot of opposition we're being faced with here. Um... Okay, that's a good start. Okay, then we can flip this guy. Boop. And I can press the wrong button because I got distracted. Dang it. Uh, we'll be okay though. Level up! Okay, so that fully heals us. It restores all our stats to full, which is great. Uh, then we're gonna get a bit more health. There we go. I thought we might get something else as well, but we did not. Hello. Zzz. Darn, with the workers sleeping, how will we operate the cranks? Leave it to me, beam rung expresses go, for a small fee. Of zero berries. <laughs> sleeping on the job is so lazy, maybe we should throw some ice on him. Oh, we cover his face with honey. Stop it, you'll do none of those things. The Golden Settlement is a pioneer of wind-based energy, isn't it? Uh-huh, and for heavier stuff they wind up cranks to move around. It's a pretty clever way to move about. The bee engineers deserve some praise. Yeah, it's nothing special. Most bees can fly. It's no wonder you wouldn't see the greatness in the, these inventions. Hmm. So yeah, um, we need to throw our beam ring at that thing. Like so. Oh gosh, okay. Uh, we'll start with the flip. Boop. Okay, now we just have the numbnail to worry about. Uh, v will get healed automatically by her sleep. Quite helpful. <laughs> there 
There we go. Job done. Oh, we are nearly through the golden path, by the way. It's not very long. this just wanted to make sure I'd, I'd seen it cool oh okay we need to tattle on that guy at the front there uh... let's have leaf do it I reckon Whoa, easy there. This beast doesn't look like it can be reasoned with. It's quite fierce too, we should discipline it before it can give us much trouble. Yeah, it just attacks the other enemy to heal itself. It's quite fearsome. Um... V doesn't do a whole lot of damage just yet, but she will. She's gonna get super strong. Uh... Warning, do not cross the spike pit. That sounds like a challenge. I want to cross the spike pit now. Ice fall. Uh, that just buffed their attack. That's what that red symbol means. With the up arrow and the, and the one. Uh, which is why they did so much damage even though I perfectly blocked it. Which is one of the reasons they can be so threatening. Uh, so yeah, uh, we can't cross the spike pit yet, so the advice to not cross the spike pit is something we have to agree to, but we're going to be crossing this spike pit. <laughs> What a huge gap. This place is known for its hills. No problem for me, I can just fly over them. What about us? You would not abandon us, would you, V? I apologize for Snake Mouth already, I'm not going to abandon you. Oh, V, sweetie. I just, I really like her, okay? She's a really cool character. I mean, we can probably afford to fight a few more things. Oh gosh, that's that's quite an arrangement. Wasn't really expecting this many dudes. <laughs> uh. Oops. I'm 
I'm not sure you can actually flip this guy, which is kind of weird because the tattle from V said you were supposed to. That's not going to do any damage because when they're in the shell they have poor defense. Which we cannot pierce yet with any of our attacks. Even a heavy strike only does exactly four. Oh, that worked. I guess Kabu can just pierce that because he's got defense piercing, but I thought it was only one point of defense piercing, so... Hmm. I'm a little confused. We got a numbnail dart. Might be handy. It's a little bit more damage, and we're good. And here we are in the Golden Settlement. The settlement's entrance is so pretty. I just love the sunflowers. <laughs> it's so unusual to see V so chirpy. Make sure she doesn't hear you or we won't hear the end of it. Oh, what a sweetie. Do -do -do -do. Uh, excuse me, extremely round beetle. Oi, don't interrupt me. I'm gonna move this rock. This rock is extremely heavy. You will hurt your horn. I'm a fully grown tangerine. I can do it. I can move this rock. Let the little dude do his job, Kabu. I'm not little, I'll fight you right here. It's so cute. How can we feel threatened at all? I came from a very far land from the right to prove my might. I'll break this rock, then I'll be the strongest. It works that way? I admire your spirit, but horns cannot withstand such pressure. You should take care. My horn can never break, because I'm strong. Now I'm going right back to work. It was cute at the start, but now I'm kind of worried. So he came from a far land. Any idea of which? I've heard of one region where bugs look like seeds and berries. I've heard of that place too. Uh, in fairy tales? So those tales could be real. We should go there someday. Da da da. Hello. S -s 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 -s. Sleeping on the job. Standards have dropped. Oi, I wasn't sleeping called a power nap. Whatever you say. What's a miner doing all the way out here? It's Diana, okay? I'm here on the Queen's orders. I'm finishing up the tunnel in the Golden Path to the Ant Kingdom. Goodness gracious, you've dug all that distance? Eh, it was kind of a team effort. I just have to cut the rope, really. What are you waiting for, then? Hmm, honestly, I worked so hard, I'm a bit tired. I need a good rest to power through. Or if I ate some berries now, I could probably get it done right now. Like, 15 maybe? Oh, maybe we could help. Kabu, she just wants free food. We can come back later and it'll be done. Think about it though. It'd be nice to be able to walk back just in case. Hmm, you'll have to think about this. Well, give me a holler if you make your mind up. Okay, so the deal here is, Diana shows up pretty much in every chapter of the game, uh, and you can unlock a shortcut back to the Ant Kingdom by paying her in berries. It costs a lot more than 15 later on, but it can be helpful uh, to pay her in order to get the shortcut sooner. Uh, if you actually finish chapter two, the shortcut opens automatically. Um, I'm probably not gonna be paying her except one of the tunnels. We'll see what we get, see how we go. Diana seems to hold massive strength. What if she joined our team? She'd punch holes through spiders. It's a shame. If she wasn't so committed to her job, it'd be such a great help. 
uh, anyway, uh, we are at exactly a half hour, so I am going to wrap up for this video. Uh, the save point is just through here, so I'm gonna whack it, and next time, we're gonna hang out in the Golden Settlement and have a nice time. <laughs> uh, here's the save point. Would you like to save? Yes! Saving, please stand by, save complete. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Bye! <laughs> Oh my goodness. Um, yeah, that's it for now. Bye.